Today is Wednesday, beautiful day. It turned out to be a 50 degree day. Right now it's about almost one o'clock and I'm riding behind the schedule. I have a, a pick set up and a guy in Wisconsin just passed the border in a city called Genoa City. Um, apparently has a lots and lots of vintage and antique stuff, which I'm very careful when it comes to things like that what I'm buying right now because uh, it has to be either very small that I can put it online and ship it or super super unique for me to bring it in a shop so I can sell it in a shop so yes I am excited anxious to see all this stuff but extremely picky at the same time because all this stuff right now it's kind of in a standstill you know the vintage and antique stuff you know people don't have the money um, to spend on, on things like that so but anyway I should be there very uh, very soon and we'll see I don't know if I'm gonna be able to film there we'll see yeah but like all this stuff as much I enjoy it and like it it's it's dead stuff right now you know I can't, but Peter you might have to I don't turn, that, you might have to turn back into Craigslist, <laughs> Craigslist. <laughs> look at this guy look at him so I don't know if the camera Adrian is gonna do the justice, but this one is about a 200 pounder. Then we have a beautiful, beautiful fox here. Look at him. He looks, looks almost like a Maine Coon. <laughs> Look at all these guys. So we got three, four deer heads here. When, when, when? When is this came from? Like, how old is it? And when? It's a two year old mount. Two year old mount, okay. The oldest one on there, Peter, is the one with the yellow tag on it. He's four years old. This guy? Yep. Okay. We got a beautiful muskie, nice crappie, beautiful walleye, a bass, a couple bluegills. We got a squirrel. Fox squirrel. We have a white goose Snow up there. Goose. And this is an antelope. Yep. What is this guy? A mink. That's a mink? Yeah. Huh. So there's quite a few pieces here. And of course we got these two guys. Look at this guy. Beautiful. And then in the other room you showed me... Oh, we got these two guys hanging on a wall here. These two guys, these, Peter, and then this one. And you said these are, these are from Alaska? And a couple of these guys hanging here and that that's actually pretty awesome mount. I love it how it's done that you think he's floating in a water you can see his legs underneath so that's a very cool piece nice yeah they don't they don't do those that pedal car was included too right no, I'm just <laughs> no I sell BBs all day long I don't sell real firearms but I sell BBs yeah but this is cool but that's that's pretty cool too coasters Hobby Lobby. <laughs> yeah but that's a cool idea. The old, uh, it's not a singer, it's a Stratford, but. So this is a, a Pi server that he just screwed on there and then whatever he just did. Just bend, right? Yeah. You just bend it. Whatever he did. This is your steering wheel. Yeah. <laughs> it's a pretty cool idea. And then just a couple, you know, wheels and and it almost looks like this guy. Right. So you know? Peter, I was, so... Going to, I was going to sell and he happened to have this and he's like, dude, Give me 20 bucks for it, you can have it. I'm like, you know what, I'll take it because it make a great centerpiece on my 20 island. bucks, yeah. yeah. And I love that too. Look at that kind of upside down. That's an excellent idea. You get the right person, right mansion that wants a great chandelier, there it is. I know, you, you need like a cabin way up north that it's 1.6 million and that needs to be hanging in the entryway. Yeah, I know. You know what I mean? Peter, I gotta yeah. retire first, Peter. I'm still young. I'm working, man. I'm still swinging a hammer. So absolutely beautiful collection of taxidermy that he has there. That's what he mainly wants to sell to me. Not so much the the vintage, you know, pedal cars and the antique stuff. He he wants to get rid of the the taxidermy. Everything that I guys showed you in that video, like the like the bear, the fox. Um, there's four deer heads, coyote, fish, elk. I mean, there's there's a lot of stuff in there. He's asking $4,500. And 
at this time I don't know if I can swing that meaning I I have a few deer heads right now in a shop and they've been there for a while and what he's asking here that's what I'm asking in my shop so on the normal circumstances when the market is hot and good when it comes to taxidermy it's not a bad price actually you could probably get maybe six grand out of the stuff that it's there uh, maybe 6500 on a really good day but at the moment I think what he's asking there about 4500 I like I think 5000 would be the max that you can get out of this stuff so I would probably be buyer at about 2000 2500 so I'm gonna show this to agent we'll talk about it but uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make a deal with him so I think we might be a little bit too far apart you know it's different if somebody would be buying this collection for themselves just to hang it up like I would buy it and put it in my house different ball game very good price but for me to flip it and make money on it I don't think so you know I mean like he wants twelve hundred dollars alone for that beer and uh, and I think that's a good price but not not for me to flip it so all right I'm gonna head back to the shop and we'll see what else happens today you know what I need to be careful this is a knife That's not for you. That's for me. It's not, look, this is for me. That's for me. There's my shark there. Oh, these are so good. St. Paul, Minnesota, job side box. That's an awesome sticker. You know, I go to Minneapolis, St. Paul all the time. My daughter lives there. Look at that for Ruby. Ruby, look at all the goodies. And this is for you, hon. Here, let's see if she's gonna eat those. Rub, we got stuff here. Yeah, yeah, look. Grab it, grab it, it's a banana, it's a dry banana, come on, yeah, good girl, yeah, you like it, yeah, mm-hmm, you have to be in a way, always, all right. look at all the goodies you got, well, look at all the dry food, it smells good, yeah, yeah, <laughs> Yeah, there you go. Yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. Try it. Uh-huh. Yeah. Guys, thank you so much. We do appreciate it a lot, especially these two guys. All right, Travis, your sticker, your decal is going on a wall with the rest of the YouTubers. Let me peel yours. Can't peel it. What's going on? There it goes. All right, let me squeeze you right here. Barter Mania. I'll check your YouTube channel out, guys. Go check uh, Travis' new YouTube channel. Barter Mania by Sell and Trade. What's that? I gotta try these. Pecans? I'm a red all. So good. Mm. They're so good. We're red all. We just got a gift. A bunch of chocolate. More goodies for honey and ruby. Mm. They're spoiling us again. That's really good. These are, <laughs> this is gonna disappear quickly. So as soon as Adrian gets hold of these, they're gonna be gone in a minute. He locked for the day. They even, he never has to know about them. No, he's coming back. He just went to get a haircut. <laughs> I just meant let's just eat them really fast. <laughs> Somebody send him even a cigar. Hey. Canudo inspirado. Adrian is testing. Smelly, smelly test. 
smelly, smelly test. Good cigar. Yeah. Nice. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks, Art. Thank, Har. You. Thank yep. you very much. Appreciate it. Thank you.